In this video we will review how to define groups and custom properties for your project, which are features available in the Connected and Enterprise plan. Other available properties are reviewed in the previous video. User with a project leader role can add and update these properties from BIM Collab web application only. Let's start from the Groups tab in the Project Settings page. Groups represent subteams within your project, and typical project subteams are added as default groups. New groups can be added by clicking on the plus icon, or removed by clicking on the minus icon under the group name. Existing group names can be edited by clicking on the name of the group. Once groups are defined, users can be assigned to one or multiple groups in the team member settings. From the team member tab, click on the name of the required user and assign them to the required groups. Groups really come in handy when it comes to issue visibility and defining which members can view which issues. Once the groups have been set up by the project leader, they can be assigned in the visibility field of the issue properties. Here you can select from any of the created groups and the issue will only be visible for members of that group. Groups can also be used to activate a project setting where issues can only be assigned to team members within your own group. Click on the Edit Project button in the top right corner and turn on the toggle for issues to only be assigned to team members in same groups. The next property tab, Custom Fields, allow you to create fields which can be used to add additional information to the issues in the project. There are four customizable fields that can be used. Two lists fields that can be used to select a predefined value, and other two text fields which can be used to enter free form text. The project leader can choose which custom fields are available for the project. Click on Edit Project button and turn off the toggle for any custom fields you wish to deactivate. Deactivated fields will not be available in issue properties. As a project leader, you can set up a custom field by, first, entering the name of the custom field you wish to create, and clicking save. An example use of the field can be cost effect, and additional information to define about the issue, which will indicate the cost impact the issue might have on the overall budget of the project. After naming the custom field, add the value options. For example, the predefined values team members can assign to issues can be, no cost, low cost, or high cost effect. For the text custom field, we can use the same example and also name the field cost effect. The list and text field are immediately available in the issue menu, where team members can select required values or type the actual estimated cost number. Custom fields, like all other properties, can be reviewed in project graphs in BIM Collab or through Power BI where you can extract BIM Collab data and create customizable reports. Now that you've learned how to define groups and custom fields, watch the next video to learn more about the BIM Collab workflow.